hey guys welcome back to my channel so um, today I'm gonna be looking at supplements what are the best supplements for your skin or what I normally use for my skin this is what I do on a daily basis so how I start my day is I take uh, my supplements I do that on an empty stomach so the supplement that I take first is your omega-3 so your omega-3 is your fatty, your fatty acids which are the, the, the good fats that your body needs on a daily basis. Omega-3 is also good if you're trying to lose weight because believe it or not, we're, these fats are good for your body. So if you're trying to lose weight to this, I only take one capsule. So this is how the capsules look like. I take one capsule, a glass of water, and that's it. Sometimes some people complain that it gives them an, 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 an aftertaste on their mouth of feeling the oils and 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 the best way to avoid that is to keep your omega-3 in the, in the fridge. I prefer the IPS one because I, I was just exposed to it when I needed to get to, uh, to use omega-3 or when I found out that omega-3 was good for the skin. This is the one product where I had the samples and it also didn't give me the aftertaste. But like I say, if you do have um, another one or the one that is available at uh, pharmacies or wherever and it gives you enough to taste, just make sure that you put it in the fridge and from the fridge then you can drink it. It, it, it eliminates that aftertaste smell of the, of the product. But this is very good for your skin. It helps nourish your skin from within, which is something we forget to do most of the time. We always think skin and we think outside. This helps you to nourish your skin from within. It helps with antioxidants as well. That gives your skin...